Adeline. <gasps> Wait, Adeline marries Neil? Y'all, the way I just spoiled my own Royal Regency series for me. Hello everyone and welcome back to another royal family tree video. This is the most updated royal family tree as far as season 3 of my royal family series. We have not started season 3 yet. This is coming out right before the first episode of season 3. If you're new here and you don't know what my royal family series is and you want to check it out, I will link a helpful video below for you to go ahead and start with. We have a lot of families to get to and a lot of sims to get to, so let's go ahead and get started. So this here is just a quick royal family peek in game in the actual sims game but however i will not be using the sims game to show my royal family tree today i'm going to be using a site called tribal pages here's what it looks like on tribal pages this is public there's a link to it in the description so if you want to go ahead and follow along while i'm going through it then you can absolutely do that i will be going through seven royal family trees today however a lot of them link and intertwine so they're kind of the same but here is just a peek of what we are about to get into today this tree was originally made by Ash, one of my moderators. She spent two years on this, so thank you, Ash. This is the most helpful thing in the entire world. It just keeps going. This is the most helpful thing in the entire world, and I am so indebted to you, so thank you so much. I have made some edits. I had one video before this that showed off the tree, but let's go ahead and get into it, and we're going to start with the Windenburg royal family. So I have a mini series called The History of Windenburg, where we actually get to see the first rulers of Windenburg. We have King Henry, and he was originally married to Queen Caroline. However, she does not fall into the tree. Now Ravenna is our kind of main matriarchy. Is that it? So Ravenna had three kids with Henry. She had Mary, Elizabeth, and Raina. And then she had a couple kids with Arthur. If you want to know the backstory to this, you can go ahead and watch my History of Windenburg miniseries. With Arthur, she had Henry, Isabel, and Derek. Derek married Anne, they had Bryce and Anna. Isabel married William, they had Stefan and Avery. And Henry married Sybil, and they had Kellen, Mara, and John. John married Jane, Mara married Matthew, and Kellen married Isla. If you are watching my Royal Regency series currently, some of these sims in this generation might look recognizable. So Kellen and Isla, they had Henry and Emily. Henry ended up becoming King Henry III, and he married married Ezra. Emily married King William of Willow Creek. We will talk more about Emily and William when we get to the Willow Creek royal family, so I will just talk about Henry and Ezra, but Henry and Ezra, they had Eliza, Mira, they had Arya, and they had George. George became the king of Winnenberg. Before we get into that though, I will just show you kind of the side characters, the side siblings who they had. So Mara and Matthew, they had John and Lydia, and then John and Lydia ended up having Myra who married Keith. Jane and John, they had Louis and Carol. Carol married Irving and Louis married Amaya. And then over here, you might recognize some of these. Also, the pictures are a bit different. So when Ash made these, she made the Sims herself. So that's why some of the pictures might look, if you're familiar with my Royal Family series, that's why some of the pictures might not look completely the same, but I am working on updating them if I have the Sims. Like the Sims for my Royal Regency series, I will add current pictures in here, but I'm very thankful for Ash to give an idea of what they look like for you guys so you guys can see at least. And then do Duke Locks, well, where did Duke Locks come from? Hold on. Okay, interesting. Okay, so Sybil, her brother was Duke Loxus. Their parents were Duke Richard and Duchess Edith. Loxus married Jane. They had Edward and Edward married Caitlin. Edward and Caitlin, they had Lady Anna, Chaya, Emmett, and Liliana. Liliana married Houston. They had Thomas, who married Stella. And they also had Deacon, who married Julia. They had Cassie, who married Edson. I think it's supposed to be Edison, but back then I didn't have the longer names cheat, so that's it's supposed to be Edison and Cassidy. But they also had Irving, who married Carol, and then Chaya and Henry. They had Colton, who married Mira, who we talked about a second ago, and then they also had Adeline. <gasps> wait, Adeline marries Neil? Wait, wait, 
Wait, y'all, the way I just spoiled my own Royal Regency series for me. Okay, if you don't, if you're not watching the series, you have no idea what I'm talking about and why I'm surprised right now. But if you watch the series, you know why I'm shocked. Oh my God, how do I get back to where I was? This, this tree is so confusing. <gasps> oh my God, my mind is blown. I just spoiled my own series end games for myself. <laughs> okay. I told everyone anyway that they were, you know, like they could look on the family tree if they want spoilers. I just like was avoiding checking. <laughs> ah! Oh my God, my mind is blown. Okay, where was I? Okay, back to the Wittenberg royal family. Um, okay, so Henry and Ezra, they, I already went over their kids. Let's, let's go down, let's go down here. So Henry and Eliza, they had, f and, sorry, not Eliza. Henry and Ezra, they had four kids. A daughter, Eliza, which I just said, married Ross. Every time I think of Ross, I think of friends. They had Matthew and Franklin. Eliza and Ross had Matthew and Franklin. Matthew married Valentina and Franklin married Malia. And then Henry and Ezra's daughter, Mira, she married Colton. They had Peter and they had Caleb. Peter married Olivia and Caleb married Shauna or Shanna. I guess not, because there's no you in there. And then Arya married King Easton of Oasis Springs, so we'll talk about their family when we get to the Oasis Springs royal family. And then George, George became king. We know him pretty well if you have watched the first season of my royal family series. So George married Isabel, and they had Henry, he's the oldest, and they had Cora and Anna. Henry married Alice and Evangeline. I'll get to that in a second. Why don't we go to their family tree here so we can see the offspring. So Cora married the King of Willow Creek and we'll get to them in a second when we get to the Willow Creek royal family. And then Anna married Marshall. They had three girls, they had Ezra, Aurora and Sadira. Wish they would show their kids right now, but Ezra married Jaden. They have two kids who I'll get to in a second. And then we have Aurora who married Duke Kona. They have four kids. And then we have Sadira who married King Johan, who we'll get to when we get to the Brindleton Bay royal family. Also, side note, the kingdom name and their last name might change. So stay tuned for the first episode of season three for that information. Also, you guys are about to see, if you are watching my royal family series, you might see some new babies on here that we have not seen before so I can't wait to introduce you guys to the little ones soon but yeah we'll get to them in just a second all right so King Henry he married Queen Alice they had Amira they had May and they had Kellen and then after Alice King Henry married Evangeline and they had three kids they had twins Charles and Bellatrix and Diana I'll show you guys Anna's, Princess Anna's kids really, really quickly. So Ezra, or her grandkids, Ezra and Jaden, they had Winston and Thaddeus, Aurora and Kona, they had Nani. The, so we have partners on here. They're not married yet. Um, they're not married yet. Oh shit. Oh my gosh. I'm also realized that I didn't update her picture. I thought I did. So she's a teenager now. She's, Nani's the oldest by a lot. And then there's Tally and then twins, Nikau and Keone. So Tally's supposed be a teenager as soon as you guys can click on the link for this that will be updated so that one will be updated apologies for missing anything and then again we'll get to Sadira and Johanna in a bit and then for Henry now we're getting to our modern day so Henry and Alice's youngest Kellen he married Megan who is the princess of Oasis Springs they had Lord William who does have a partner although she's not on the family tree but we will see them in season three and then Amira and Jabari they had Alice May and Cedric. I didn't want to spoil their looks, so these, not all of the looks are completely updated. They still might look familiar as to what they looked like at the end of season two, just because I, I wanted some of their looks to be a surprise. So we will see that later. But Alice May and Caspian are not married. They have just been dating for a very, very long time. But again, that might change soon. So we shall see. And then for Evangeline and Henry, their kids, Charles married Fallon and they had twins, Cambridge and Felix. Their daughter Bellatrix married Samaria and they had Nohea and Oceana. 
and oh, no hey as you can see is a teenager now Cambridge and Felix are so close to turning into a teenager they're basically preteens you'll see that they're a little bit taller than some of the other kids in season three but they will be turning into teenagers soon and then Princess Diana their youngest became the Baroness and she married Abraham and they had Vincent and Samuel so that is it for the Windenburg royal family and now let's talk about the Willow Creek royal family all right for the Willow Creek royal family so their kingdom started with King Edward and Queen Lillian they had three they had three kids they had Hans Elena and Jane. Jane married John. I think I did, did I already go over this? I think I did go over this. I might not have gone over their kids, but Jane married John. They had Carol and Irvine. Carol and Irving, oh Irving. They had Clara and Darcy. Clara married Lucian and Darcy married Davian. And then Louis and Maya, they had Keith and Ross. I think I did talk about them. Keith married Myra and Ross married Eliza. And then Elena, their daughter had, or not had, she married Simon. They had Ezra. Oh, that's her parent. Okay, sorry. I was like, I didn't recognize them for a second. Okay, yes, that's her parents. So Ezra and Jacob. Jacob married Bria. And they had Edson who married Cassie. And then Ezra and Henry. We talked about this whole family tree just a second ago, so we don't have to talk about that now. And then Hans married Ingrid. And they had William and Neil. Neil married Adeline, which is still blowing my mind. And then William married Emily. Neil and Adeline had Bentley who married Olivia. And they had Emma who married Walter. William and Emily, they had Derek. And they had Jane and Julia. And let's go see this family tree here. So Julia, I'm sorry, I know they're kind of far away, so I'm, I'm trying to get closer, but this is why I wanted to recommend that you guys follow along with the link. Hopefully I'm not going too fast. If I am, you can just turn down the speed. But Julia married Deacon. They had Olivia and Javin. Javin married Judith Ward. That was a whole thing in season one. Don't ask. And then Olivia married Peter. And then we have Jane who married Hassan and they had Walter and and Walter married Emma. Derek was married to Elena. They had Alice, who we talked about, who became the Queen of Windenburg, and they had Edmund. And then Derek had an affair with Stella, and they had Tira, and Tira married Derek. Oh, there's a lot of, oh my God, oh. <laughs> I didn't realize that was her dad's name, just spelled differently, that's awkward. Anyway, where are we? We're talking about Willow Creek, yes, Willow Creek. So King Derek, him and Elena. So yes, we talked about Alice, but Edmund, their son Edmund became the king of Willow Creek. He married Cora, who was a princess of Windenburg. I love Cora, she's so dear to me. And they had triplets. They had Louis, Jack, and Isabel or Belle. And for their tree, so we can see, let's see all the grandkids here. So Jack married Ari and became the Count Consort of Oasis Springs. Ari was the, or is the Countess, she's still alive. And then they had a son and they had a daughter. So they had a son, Gabriel, who we'll talk about when we get to the Oasis Springs royal family tree. And they had Lady Minerva who married Umar. And a lot of you guys haven't met her yet, but they had Lady Kinza. So she's an infant right now. She's very, very cute. And then we have Isabel or Belle as she's known as. She became the Countess of Brindleton Bay, which again might be changing. So Brindleton Bay and she married Count Francisco who was a Prince of Oasis Springs. They had one daughter, Lady Ariana, who married Sir Thomas Stratton. And they have a young teen, Lady Catalina, who I shared on my Instagram story, might stir up some trouble, so we shall see. And then down in our direct line for the Royal Willow Creek throne, King Louis and Queen Corinne, they had four kids. They had Cornelius, Genevieve, and twins, Elena and Juliet. Juliet's actually a little bit older than Elena, but I don't think they're organized as far as like ages go on here. But Juliet, she married Manuel. They became the Duke and Duchess of Oasis Springs. They had Priya, who's very close to becoming a teen as well. She'll be a young teen. And they had Ishana. 
And then Elena and Takshi do not plan on having kids. And Genevieve and John, they had Lady Lillian. And, oh, Genevieve's last name also is supposed to be Rosenthal. And that, that's supposed to be changed. But yeah, I will update that again on the royal family tree. Apologies if I miss anything. There's so, as you can see, so many moving pieces here. I am one person. So if there's a little bit of mistakes here and there, that's why. But you know, I'm human. It's fine. I'll change it later. And then Genevieve might also be expecting another baby possibly at the beginning of season three so we will see that soon cornelius and ellis corn farm they had bvn and if you're following my instagram you saw a picture of prince theodore and he is so cute he's so precious so that is currently the willow creek royal family tree and now we will start with oasis springs which also might maybe be changing its name soon they started with King Cash and Queen Kara, and someone pointed out to me many years ago that, oh, it's King Cash Sue, so Cashew. And I was like, oh my God, I didn't say their names out loud back then. So we have King Cashew. And then they had three children. They had Isla, Jared, and Amina. We already talked about Isla with the Wittenberg royal family tree, but Amina, she married Duke Ali, and they had Milo and Elisa. Elisa married Makan, and Milo married Beth. And then we had Jared and Irina. They had four kids. They had Sahar, Amaya, Gia, and Evita. Also, if you're watching the Royal Regency series, their pictures are not updated yet either, so I will update those soon. And then also, you might see Evita. We have an unknown on the Royal Family Tree, so in our Royal Regency series, we're gonna figure out who that unknown person is, so I'm excited for that. But Avita, she married unknown. They had Abby and Hassan. I think I already talked about Hassan and Jane, but Abby and Abby married Philip. And then Gia married Dion. They had Davian and Darcy and Lucian and, oh, sorry, they had Davion who married Darcy. They had Lucian who married Clara. Clara, Clara, yes, Clara. And then Amaya married Louis. They had Ross and they had Keith. Keith married Myra and Ross married Eliza. And then for Sahar, he married Ella. They had Easton and Elena. Elena married the King of Willow Creek, who we talked about. And then Easton married Arya. So when we click on them here, you guys can see the kids here. Oh my gosh, there's so many. So the well, I'll just go off of like the siblings and their offspring. So Hassan and this is, yeah, his sister Avita had Hassan. Hassan married Jane. They had Walter who married Emma. And then Abby married Philip. They had Scott. Connor and Blair. Uh, oh, I'm excited to show. We'll, we'll talk about Connor when we get to Guangxi, but Scott married Natalie and Blair married Addis. Oh, Blair was also, okay, hold on. We'll get to this in a, oh, oh. Okay, well, hold on. I'll get to that in a minute. Gia and Deonta, they had Davian and Lucian. Davian and Darcy had Sean and Minx. Oh, they had Sean, Minx, and Kaylin. Not Caitlin, Kaylin. Kaylin married Daniel, could Katarina, oh wait, sorry. Oh my gosh, it's so confusing. Kaylin married Daniel. Minx didn't marry anyone. Sean married Katarina. Okay, moving on. Lucian and Clara, they had Jillian, who was, uh, we'll also talk about in a second, and they had Natalie. Natalie married Scott. Oh my goodness, Amaya, her kids, Ross and Eliza, they had, I already talked about, okay, I don't have to talk about them, I already talked about them, but Amaya, their other child, Keith, married Myra, they had Derek, who married Tierra, and then Elena and Derek, we've already talked about them, I don't have to talk about them, so Easton and Arya, they had Jared and Adrian, and this will lead into our Brindleton Bay royal family, but let's talk about Jared, so, Jared married, oh no, wait, no, let's not talk about Jared. <laughs> let's talk about Adrian. We'll talk about Jared in a moment. So Adrian, this bad, oh man. Viewers said they wanted a king with a lot of affairs and I gave it to them. So Adrian, he was married to, oh no, oh dear, go away. He was married to Lindsay. They had four kids, Nea, Francisco, Michael and where's your other child? Where's Megan? Oh, Megan's right there. Okay, <laughs> there's so many people out here. So they had four kids and then Adrian had affairs, multiple. Adrian and Blair had Benjamin and Kara. Kara married Lucas, Benjamin married 
Aaron, and then Jillian and Adrian, King Adrian, had Isadora. I love that name, we need to reuse that name. Isadora, who married Nathaniel, and they had Lady Cassidy. And then Harmony had Charlotte, and that is meh, meh. You wanna, meh, okay, just watch season two if you wanna know what I'm talking about. But Lindsay, so their four children, We'll talk about them. Lindsay and Adrian, so they're, they're four kids. So the youngest, Michael, he married Helen, or did he marry? Yeah, he did marry Helena and they got a divorce, but they had a Jay and they had a Rosalind. I'll get to their kids. Well, actually, let me just show you their kids right now. So Rosalind and Romeo, they had Rana, who is a child currently. And then I'll go back up here. And oh my gosh, their children are so hard to find. You're over here. All the children are over here. Okay, Megan and Kellen, we talked about that. They had William. And then Francisco and Isabel, we talked about them too. Cool, easy, done. Nea married Prince Consort Philip, I love him. They, she married Philip. They had four kids, Aria, Kimmy, Aisha, and Manuel. And then for them, so Manuel, I already talked about them, married Juliet. They have Priya and Ashana. Aisha's not having kids. Kimberly, Mary, oh no, I forgot. <gasps> no, I forgot to update the Sulani royal family tree. Oh! oh my gosh, well, we'll get to Solani later in this video and I'll have it updated for that. Okay, ignore them for now. How could I forget? Okay, ignore them. We'll get to them in a moment. But Arya and Gabriel, they adopted Sahar. And that's it for Oasis Springs, cool, I think. Yes, all right, let's go to Brindleton Bay. Okay, Brindleton Bay is short. This is like, well, is it the shortest family? It might not be the shortest family tree, but it's short. So Brindleton Bay, derives from the Oasis Springs royal family. Jared married Nina. They ran away together. She was a commoner, so her parents didn't like her. So they ran away and they made their own kingdom. Um, so they had James and Johan. Johan's the oldest. James married Ian. They don't want to have kids. And Johan married Sidira. They had two kids, Frederick and Molly Grace. They're not married, but Molly Grace is engaged to Graham as of the end of season two. And then Crown Prince Frederick. Frederick is date, has been dating Jessica since they were children, but they're not engaged yet. People move at different paces, so they're, they're not engaged yet, but they might be fairly soon. And that was the entire Brindleton Bay royal family. <laughs> All right, so now for the Sulani royal family, I have completely updated their tree, so we will see the newbies in a second. But we started with King Halani and Queen Keala, and they had Mahaka, Ali'i, and Kaylena. Kaylena and Kaui, they had Keikoa and Leah. Leah married Marjorie, and Keikoa married Nadia. And Mahaka married Lokolani. I'll talk about them in a second. But Ali'i and Ali'i Ali'i. So Ali'i is like a noble term, sort of like a duke or something like that. Ali'i Ali'i and Ali'i Lotu. They had Makai and Kona. Makai married Lily and Kona married Aurora. And then we will get into the family tree here. But so we can see the kids. So Kaylena and Kaui, their kids. Keiko and Nadia had twins, Roman and Nyla, and Leah and Marjorie had Zachary. And Marjorie is also Queen Corinne of Willow Creek's youngest sister, if you did not know. And then Ali'i and Lotu, so their kids. Kona had, I, wait, I just updated her picture. What the heck? I swear, I must have forgotten to change it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tally. Okay, I she's a teenager. Actually, no, she's a young adult as of season three. She's a young adult, but her brothers, uh, her and Nani brothers are uh, teenagers. So I already kind of talked about Nani. I think we already went over them when I was talking about Aurora, but Nikau and Keone are twins. They are teenagers. Tally is a young adult now. Um, we got to see her as a teen in the Academic Adventures miniseries. But Makai, they, uh, Makai adopted Jessica and Lily and Makai had Iolana and Kaikoa. Kaikoa is also like a very new teen. So he's, he's kind of littler than the rest, like a preteen. Iolana is a bit more like a teenager. Um, Jessica and Frederick are young adults. Adults, which is, well, no, okay, well, hold on. They were young adults before the end of season two, my bad. But, you know, I'm just, they're so 
used, I'm used to calling them the teen group, so. And then Leilana and Dean, they had Samaria twins, Samaria and Makana. Makana was the oldest, he is the heir. And for them, oh, and they had Cleo, duh. <laughs> Oh, how could I forget Kaleo? Um, anyway, Makana and Kimmy, they had three kids. I have now updated their tree so you can see. So Ma Pilapo and Sione, they're very close to being preteens. They're twins and Wiki. And then Samaria and Bellatrix, they had Nohea and Oceaan. Nohea is a preteen right now. And that is the Sulatan royal family. So next we'll go to the royal family of the UKSD. All right, so for the UKSD, this, is, this does Get a little confusing actually. Um, so Abana was the queen um, and she married Jahim who ruled beside her even though Abana is like her, that's where the line of royalty comes from. Um, Jahim, he had a sister named Zara. So uh, I'll talk about that, but it, it, again, gets a little bit confusing, but Zara had Dahlia and Dia Dia married Carter, they had Diana, and Dahlia married Michael, who had Nadia, and Gloria, oh wait, okay, oh I was like, wait, there should be four kids, there are. Nadia, Gloria, Ali, and Chris, and then I mentioned Nadia had Roman and Nyla, and then it's for Jahim and Abana, so they had two boys, Jabari, who we talked about for the Wittenberg royal family, and Haman. Cayman and, oh my God. Okay, so these are uh, some new kids that you guys are seeing and some newly aged up kids, but Cayman married Zamora. They had Adric and Elon. Elon married Natalia, Adric married Desta, and Cayman, there was a little situation that happened, a big situation, um, but him and Azara, who is his brother's ex-fiance, <laughs> they had Sissy, Sasha Nephthys. Nephthys is her full name. Um, she is a, young adult now as of season three um and then her brothers there's quite a big age gap but elon and natalia so they had Folishade or shade for short and binta so Folishade is close to being a preteen, and then we have adric and desta who have five children okay the twins were a shock was not expecting it. Uh, they got pregnant on stream and my stream wanted me to keep them, so. <laughs> ah! um, so, Osiris is very close to being a teenager and Osiris has four younger sisters. M.M., Safan, Zola, and Fayola. Zola and Fayola, they're twins, they're wild. And yeah, Osiris is close to being a preteen. M.M.'s pretty close in age to him. They're all, honestly, they're all pretty close in age. For M.M. and, uh, or sorry, between Safan and the twins, the two younger twins, there's a little bit of an age gap, um, but they are pretty, like older toddlers, like probably turning into kids fairly soon. And that is the UKSD royal family. So next we have the royal family of Guangxi, which I will combine in with the royal family of Qingqing. I, I did this for, oh, I thought I did. I thought I changed it for the more recent ones. The accents that you guys see on Guangxi for the A and the I, they're not necessary. They're just so people know what tones they are. Tones are important in Chinese and Mandarin and also in Cantonese, um, but they are, um, I, they're not necessary when you spell it out. So I, I started deleting it for some of them and I, I didn't get to all of them yet, but if you're wondering why there's accents on some of them, that is why. So we start with Emperor Zhao and Empress Mei Lin. However, I am planning on doing a history of Guangxi at some point. And I like this because we won't know who ends up with who. We just know it has to end up with Zhao and the rest of them. Um, so look for that mini series at some point. But Emperor Emperor Zhao married Empress Mei Lin. They had three kids, twins, Araminta and Anya. The reshade's different here, that's why uh, Araminta looks like a different shade than the rest of them, but um, Araminta and Anya and then Takashi. Takashi married Elena and they do not have any kids. Anya is going to return in season three, so we'll see her. And then Araminta and Han, they had Sayori, Rin, and Mamie. Sayori is the main character in the next big arc, and we'll have our little other stories going on at the same time. Um, and we'll see a lot of Rin and Mamie as well. And then I'll show, okay, so first let me show 
the step sibling. So Maitland ended up, after Jao passed away, ended up marrying Duke Kintaro. Um, and Duke Kintaro, he had, so these are Araminta, Anya, and Takshi's step siblings. So with his ex-wife, Dara, they had Makara, Vanna, and Kai. So there are, these are new, a lot of them are new kids that you're just now meeting. Um, so Vanna and Connor are the middle child. So they already had Sota. He is now a teenager. I think he's around Zayori and Rin's age. And then Makara and Harper, they have Lord Lixen and Lady Lan. So toddler and infant. And then Kai and Hazel, they have Lord Nam and Lord Trung. That is a toddler and a child, <laughs> if you couldn't tell. So that is the step siblings of the royal family of Guangxi. So they're, they're step cousins with Sayori, Rin, and Mamie. And then for Han's side of the family, we have, we're, we, we see quite a bit of them as well in Sayori's story. So Han, he is from the royal family of Qinxing. We had Emperor Li Wei and Empress, uh, Empress Nori. <laughs> so Empress Nori passed away uh, when she was giving birth to Han. But then they had Akio, that's their oldest. He is the crown prince of Chin Ching. He married Azumi. They have two kids who are now teenagers, Kaito and Yuzuru, and Tai and Admiral Jung. They had a kid, we've met Shen from when he was a toddler. He's a very, very sweet kid, but he's now a young adult, which is wild. And then of course we know Han and, and Araminta and they're three girls. And that is the whole family tree. Oh my gosh. <gasps> They felt quicker, I feel like. Actually, well, I don't know. Maybe that was kind of long. I'm not sure. Anyway, that is our family tree that will help set up for the next series, or not the next season, sorry, the next season of the Royal Family series. There is like one, I think just Genevieve is the current one pregnant, but we're gonna have another baby season because we're gonna have another wedding season soon. We're gonna have a wedding season at the beginning of season three, and then we're going to have a baby season. So there will be more babies added to this tree. I will make sure to update it. You can check back. I don't wanna do just, you know, another Royal Family tree video right after those babies are born. It'll probably be a little bit more time until that happens, maybe like a little bit more midway into season three, but just so you know. So if you were excited to see all the new babies on here, we have some new children um, and some new updates from here, but a lot of the updates are going to be in the first episode of season three of the Royal Family series, which will be out in a couple weeks from the time this video is posted. I cannot wait for you guys to see it. There are some surprises. There are some new characters. There's gonna be some new stuff going on and we're gonna have a lot of drama happen in season three. So I'm very excited for you all to see it. And so you don't miss that first episode. Make sure you are subscribed and turn on that notification bell and I will see you guys in season three of The Royal Family. Bye!